Hello students, welcome to Sorosa class. For detailed information about our classes, you can just visit our website that is www.sorosaclasses.com and if you need study materials or full videos of our courses, then you can just call us or whatsapp us at this number 9836-793076. You can even like our videos and subscribe our channel for further more videos. Today we are discussing some questions on general knowledge and here is one of the most interesting question. The question is the known forces of nature, the known forces of nature can be divided into four classes that is gravity, electromagnetism, weak nuclear force and strong nuclear force. The reference to them which one of the following statement is not correct is not correct now here four options are given option a that is gravity is the strongest is the strongest out of the four forces option b that is electromagnetism acts only on particles with an electric charge option c that is weak nuclear force causes radioactivity and option D and the last one is strong nuclear force holds protons and neutrons inside the nucleus here is nucleus of an atom so wait let me change the color ok and here we go so statement A, statement A that is gravity is the strongest out of the four forces is incorrect since gravity, gravity is actually, gravity is actually the weakest of the four fundamental forces, the weakest of the four fundamental forces for a given distance. Electromagnetism acts only on charged particles. Electromagnetism electromagnetism acts only on charged particles and where the charge can be negative or positive. So this charge of the particles can be negative or positive. Now weak force is responsible for the existence and structure of atomic nuclei including radioactivity and nuclear fusion. Strong nuclear force strong nuclear force force is responsible for holding for holding the protons and neutrons together inside the atomic nucleus and is 100 times stronger than electromagnetism so here option A that is gravity is the strongest out of the four forces is our answer. Option A is not correct. Again our next question is a very very interesting question. The question is during a thunderstorm the thunder in the sky is produced by the and here options are given. Statement 1 that is meeting of cumulonimbus 
clouds in the sky lightning that separates the nimbus clouds and violence upward movement of air and water particles and we have to choose any one of those four options so let's proceed to the answer thunder is thunder is simply the sound produced by lightning the sound produced by lightning it produces a sudden increase in the pressure and temperature increasement increasement in pressure and temperature of air surrounding and within the bolts from the clouds to nearly tree or roof a lightning bolt takes only a few thousands of a second to split through the air the loud thunder that follows the lightning bolt is commonly said to come from the bolt itself from the bolt this causes a rapid expansion of the air and creates a sonic shock wave which produces the typical sound of the thunder so here option d that is none of this is our correct answer so none of this statement is correct